Ah, oh, jeez, Duffy. Yep. Hour and a half late. Well, if you forgot my coffee again, I'm gonna turn into a groggy beast. You get lost or something, run out of gas again, Duffy. Flat tire, house fire, meet a townie. Glenn? What the hell are you doing here? But, uh, Duffy couldn't hack the stakeout life any longer or something? <laughs> huh. Something like that. Here, let me take those. Hey man, it's been a while and I'm glad you still remember what I take in my owl juice. I tell you, you would not want to be around me out here without it. I get real grumpy after dark. Hmm. Vanilla soy latte. Man, I do not get you new guys in this triple bean soup. I need the black stuff to hit me right in the gut before I feel anything these days. That's the way you do that. So what are you guys doing out here? Sort of the middle of nowhere. Your guess is as good as mine. Cal is only on for a few weeks. I'm on month two. We have notes all over the mountain. Cal, Chris. Zach, Andrew, Graham, Terry, pretty much the entire OG field crew is uh, stationed out here now. Sounds like a pretty big operation. What are we looking for? Real limited intel. Surveillance, it seems. It's mostly just a sit, watch, and wait situation. Hey, we got the cushy gig here, man. Cal's cabin, three miles north, it is a cold, crummy shack. I ping him on the walkie just to poke him about it every now and again. So, what happened to Duffy? I didn't think you got much field action these days. Duffy? Eh. He couldn't make it this time. He wasn't holding up well. I was just floating around and available to fill in. Yeah, well. This is a long one. It's not for everybody. I guess things must be pretty slow for you back at HQ, huh? Yeah, well. Don't worry. Things are a hell of a lot slower out here. I am actually really relieved to see you, man. If I had to put up with Duffy's cartoons and He-Man quotes much longer, I think I was gonna lose my mind. Sounds like he already lost his. Uh, the kid's a good agent. Usually very detail-oriented. He's just not cut out for this long-term remote work. Honestly, think he was starting to go a bit screwy hold up out here. He doesn't like how quiet it gets. Always kinda needs that tech fix even out here in the sticks, you know. Oh, this? Oh yeah, we have full camera and mic coverage out here. Proximity relay sensors, too. Each station is pretty kitted out, actually. Sat feed, back down the hill. We got all the goodies. Impressive. Yeah. You seen anything yet? In two months? No. No. Not really. Well, I... I did see a bear across the river last week. Had a nice little one-sided conversation about life and dreams. Pretty good listener. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Occasionally we get a logging truck up on the road during the day and this place turns into a ghost town at night. Every couple weeks we get the IT guys up to check on all the kit. That seems like a lot of effort for nothing to me. Yeah, well, I, I don't get it myself. All of this, just to watch trees grow all day. You know, we don't even know what we're looking for. Cal was the first one on site earlier this year, and the briefing just mentioned looking for anything outside of the ordinary. Outside the ordinary? Outside of the ordinary. Uh, well, trust me, every day for two months has been alarmingly ordinary. With the exception of my growing fondness for chatting with the occasional woodland creature. Seems like they're keeping you good company. You and I have had far worse days on the job, that's for sure. And besides, it gives me plenty of time to catch up on my reading, which I've been meaning to do for forever, so. Well, don't worry about me. I like it quiet. Mm. Can't hear myself think in the city. Here's to enjoying that quiet and getting out of that city life. I can certainly drink to that. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, that certainly makes life easier. <laughs> well, I usually check in with Cal in a couple hours, but if you don't mind, in the meantime, I'd like to dig back in. Oh. I don't know if you're much of a reader, but take your pick. Probably got plenty of time to get through a few of those while you're out here. some emergency lights in the kitchen. Do you copy? Over. What the hell was that? What the hell are you doing? Going somewhere? The cameras are still down. Looks like the satellite feed is down too. It's just around back. See if you can get Cal on the radio. I'll be back in five minutes. And check the power to the satellite dish. If we don't get in touch with Cal in 10 minutes, we'll go up to his cabin.
Glenn, the cable is severed. The dish is definitely down too. What's going on back there, Glenn? Glenn, do you copy? What the... Duffy? 